Hey you guys, I'm Molly with Design Loves Detail and we have a brand new room reveal from our remodel project. I can't wait to show you how it turned out, so stay tuned for more. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified when our next video is live. We're going to dive right into the details of this space, which was seriously such a 90s room. It had the ceiling fan, the mint green carpet, even the furniture was kind of old school. And now we updated it. So no more mint green carpet, no more of, of that kind of dingy yellowish paint color. We freshened everything up. And now we have this room that is a great guest suite. It connects to that bathroom that we shared recently that has uh, the shower uh, with the fun tile from Riyadh Tile. And this uh, nightstand is a, a fun place to start because these hopefully will be back in stock soon, but I love that they have that open center section for like decor and then you still have the closed storage as well with the two different drawers. So those are, are really cute and they're kind of a grayish, a really pale grayish tone. These lamps from Target are such a good deal. They're a new arrival. I've linked them for you guys in stories, but I will put them into the descri description again because they are a nice scale and a really good price point. And the shades are from Target as well. They do sell them separately, but I'll include those. I love having a little box like this little decorative box on the nightstand because you can kind of put your TV remotes or random jewelry stuff, crap, anything general, <laughs> general crap, uh, right there, right on your nightstand. And then this bed was one that I feel like made such a statement because it's got the woven leather detail. So it brings in a different texture. I love using like mixed materials where it has I don't know, some type of that artisan feel. I'm always talking about that, kind of bringing in products that, that have uh, totally different materials and feels to them for interest. So uh, linen for these um, pillow shams, these are the Euro size. The big square ones are about 26 by 26. And I use these for beds a lot. We still have the sleeping pillows back here behind, but this gives um, kind of a little bit cleaner look so that you don't just have your sleeping pillows, which sometimes can't, can be like not as pretty, um, especially after you've like slept on them for a while. So these give a nicer face to the bed. And these are from the company store. They've got this new linen line that is so, so pretty. This is color shale. And this fun number, this is another one of those um, extra long pillows that I love from Winobi Home. They've got these in a bunch of different neutrals and other fabrics that are so cute to just put across the front of the bed. And it keeps it simple. Like we don't have to hear the husbands complaining about there being too many pillows or something because this is like three pillows. We can, I think, be okay with that. Uh, bedding here to the duvet cover, another cotton linen blend, which I love. And the blanket also is from the company store. They have ser seriously fun bedding right now. The bench there at the end is another Target find. So super affordable. It's a faux leather and well, at least these like straps are. And again, this is just kind of that mixed material look with the wood base so that you get um, just kind of like that fun detail. And it's also kind of a smaller scale so that you could use this um, at the end of uh, maybe even a twin bed. Like just basically you don't have to have like anything too bulky. It can just kind of tuck there at the end of the bed for um, mostly for looks, but again, you know, to put your shoes on function too. The rug is a nice one. This is from Walmart. So really reasonably priced, nice and neutral and really durable as well. So also I'm gonna get a link for you for some rug tape. If you have rugs that are sliding around on carpet, uh, this might solve your problem. It kind of holds them in place. So I will include that for you. This little guy this is another fun, again, just like another little storage place. If I can open it. Oh my gosh, what happened? <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna open it. Somehow this lid. <laughs> I'm like a squirrel. <laughs> Not, I really want to show you the inside of this. This does the lid comes off. I think maybe something happened to it. Like maybe my kids did something to it. Okay, anyways, this opens up. <laughs> so you're gonna have to take my word on the fact that that thing can open. Because I know I've opened it before, but something happened to it. This artwork too here is a good one. It's one of those art prints that I've shared with you guys where they have a bunch of different options and they're like a poster print, super affordable. 
uh, for the print and then the frame and mat come together uh, as well. So you just buy that frame and you can put your art in and change out the center art whenever you want because the price on them is really good. Um, sometimes they'll be as low as like $12.99 a piece, which is pretty sweet. The blinds are another way that I added texture in this space. They are like a bamboo shade and I will include those for you. They're pretty well priced. I wanted something that still allowed a little bit of the light to pass through just because it's pretty private in the backyard, but I wanted the detail of the blinds and to be able to block like the harsh sunlight. So we have the perfect, I think, mix with this where it lets in a little bit of light uh, when they're down, but then still gives interest and, and gives some softening of the, the light. The light fixture is one from TJ Maxx, and some of you guys might have gotten this when I shared the daily deals in my Instagram story on this because it was like, gosh, I, I want to say it was like a $400 light, and they had it for like $70 or something along those lines. It's been a minute since I ordered, but they have seriously sometimes the most amazing lighting deals, so I do share those in my Instagram stories in case you guys aren't following there. Be sure to check it out um, because they I share new finds every single day. Over on this side, we have the curtains, which we added. And these ones I think are great because they do have a little bit of a lining on the back. Again, these are a TJ Maxx find. And so that'll, that'll give some privacy because it does go out to a more common area here, which is the pool. And we've got my favorite curtain rod up there. I love this. Uh, it comes in a ton of colors. It's really affordable, easy to install. I think Ben has ins installed like 20 of these because we use them in every, every project. Uh, it just goes with any space. And I love this satin brass with the um, kind of linen look of these gray, gray curtains. So it's kind of an affordable, they, they have an overall, I think a custom look without the expense because custom curtains are crazy expensive. Some of you guys probably know from having gotten them or gotten bids. Um, so, so these have, I think a really nice tailored look without, you know, being very expensive. So thanks for tuning in to check out this space. Again, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell if you haven't yet. So you get notified of all of our future videos as well.